Welcome to our lecture online. And now just for good measure, let's see if we can tackle something that's a lot more complicated. Can we follow the rules with rational expressions in order to simplify an expression like that? Well, we need to operate separately in the numerator and the denominator. Let's first tackle the numerator. So in the numerator, we have exponents raised to exponent. That means we're going to multiply the exponents. So this becomes equal to x to the 2 7 power multiply times 2 thirds power and then y to the minus 3 quarter power multiplied times 2 thirds power like that and then the denominator we'll leave that the same for now so we have x to the 3 7 times y to the minus 3 over 2 power so let's simplify what we have in the numerator by multiplying those exponents so we get x to the 2 times 2, which is 4, 3 times 7, which is 21, y, 3 fourths times 2 thirds. Notice the 3's cancel out, and the 2's becomes, this becomes 2, this becomes 1 over 2, so we end up with minus 1 half, all divided by x to the 3 sevenths power and y to the minus 3 over 2 power. Now we have the situation where we're dividing and we have exponents, so we're going to subtract exponents. So this cannot be written as x to the 4 over 21 minus 3 over 7 and y minus 1 half and then subtract the denominator which is minus a minus 3 over 2. I should say subtract the exponent in the denominator. So now we simplify that. So we have, uh, well, first of all, we can't subtract until we have the same denominator. We need a common denominator of 21, so we multiply the top and the bottom by 3. So this becomes x to the 4 over 21 minus 3 times 3 is 9. Okay. Okay. All right. Okay. So this becomes equal to x to the 4 over 21, and then minus 3 times 3, which gives us 9, and 3 times 7 gives us 21. So now we can go ahead and subtract the, the exponents because we have the same denominator. Over here, this can be written as y to the negative 1 half, and a minus times a minus becomes plus 3 halves. So now, when we let me go over here and complete the job. So this is equal to x to the... 4 minus 9, which is minus 5 over 21, and then y of minus a half plus 3 halves, that's y to the first power. And of course, we don't like negative exponents, so we bring that to the denominator. So this becomes y divided by x to the 5 over 21, and that would then be the simplified form of our original expression. And that is how it's done.